Jay Jay here and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, welcome. If you are interested in anything regarding relationships, Christian lifestyle, and tips, then this is the place for you and you want to make sure that you hit that subscribe button as well as the notification bell so you can get updates on all of my upcoming videos. If you're interested in merchandise, be sure to check the description box below for more information on Johnson Team Apparel. Today, as we're gearing up for Christmas, I want to talk to you about the greatest gift. Now, this is a Bible study video and just preparing our hearts for um, the special season. So as we prepare for this Christmas season with family time and gift exchanges, I want to encourage you to remember what's most important. This season is so special because God gave us a precious gift. We take this time to celebrate the birth of the Savior of the world, Jesus Christ. Such an exciting and special and miraculous time. You know, in Luke chapter 2, verse 11, it says, Today in the town of David, a Savior has been born to you. He is the Messiah, the Lord. Imagine, God knows that man is in a sticky situation ever since the Garden of Eden with Adam and Eve and them being disobedient to God and his instructions. Ever since then, man has had a sin problem. And when I say man, I'm talking about just the human race as a whole. And that then caused us to be born into sin and slaves to sin and deserving of eternal punishment and damnation. Not worthy to be in fellowship with God or even in the presence of a perfect and holy God. Essentially, mankind was doomed. Galatians chapter 4, verses 4 through 5 says, When the time set had fully come, God sent his son, born of a woman, born under the law, to redeem those under the law that we might receive adoption to sonship. This scripture is letting us know that there was a specific time, an ordained time, where God would send his son Jesus to be born to allow us to be able to receive adoption and sonship so that we can become part of the family of God. And we were adopted um, into the family of God as a result of what Christ has done when we believe and accept him as our Lord and Savior. So God sends his son Jesus as a sacrifice for our sin to save us from the punishment and the fate that man deserves. How awesome is that? Now that is a gift. Matthew 1 21 says she will give birth to a son and you are to give him the name Jesus because he will save his people from their sins. In Matthew it's saying that Mary will give birth to a son and um, she received instruction to name him Jesus of course and that is because he was chosen to save people from their sins, to save us from our sins. That was his purpose. Jesus is the ultimate gift because in him we receive life and salvation and right standing with God and healing and peace and joy and so much more. So as we prepare to celebrate with our family and our friends and we exchange gifts and we eat all this good food and we celebrate these traditions that we have, make sure that you slow down and thank God for the wonderful gift that he has given us. And if you have children, I encourage you to make sure that they know that God has given them an amazing gift. His gift is the greatest gift of all. Hopefully you found this video of encouragement and a blessing to you. If you did, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. I wish you all a Merry Christmas and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Bye!